down, look all around. Up in the air or on the ground. Come for a walk, come for a ride. There's so much to see, so come outside. this outside in the dark, sniffing all about? When you're fast asleep at night, hedgehogs come out. <coughs> no, Pippin, it's not for you. It's for Spiky the Hedgehog. Yes, I know it's your favourite dog food, but it's just what he likes. Anyway, you've had your supper. Oh, hello, me dears. <coughs> We've just put out some food and water for the hedgehog. I call him Spiky. He usually visits our garden at night. No sign of him yet, though. I know. Wait here. We'll go and look for him. Come on. You're not afraid of the dark, are you? Only an owl. be along later. Pippin! Perhaps Spike is overslept. Show you a photograph of him. Do you want to look too, Pippin? There he is. It was taken at night time because that's when hedgehogs are up and about. Can you guess why I call him Spiky? Hedgehogs spend most of the night looking for food. They have a strong sense of smell which helps them sniff out the things they like to eat. Like a worm. Or a beetle. Or a nice, fat, juicy slug. But hedgehogs can't see very well. Whoops! In the winter, they find a cosy place, put lots of leaves, grasses and such like in it, and go to sleep. And they don't wake up till the spring. Imagine that. 
fast asleep for the whole winter. I do hope Spikey's all right. He's had one accident this year already. <laughs> oh, dear, oh dear, what a time we had with him. I'll never forget it. Let me tell you the story. It all started one morning. Pippin was making such a noise. Oh, what a commotion. Pippin, shush. What's the matter? Spiky, what's he doing out in the daytime? Doesn't look right to me. There's definitely something wrong. Right. We'd better take you to the hospital. Pippin, <coughs> fetch your lead. It's time to fly. <coughs> Tiggywinkles. It's a very special wildlife hospital for all kinds of wild animals. Nearly there, Spikey. Um. It's a hedgehog we found in the garden. I think it's hurt its leg. OK, I'll take it down to the animal section and we'll find out what's wrong. Oh, can I come too, please? Well, we don't normally allow it, but since you're auntie, I'll let you come. Oh, thank you. Pippin, you wait here. Oh! I won't be long. Right, let's have a look at him. We'll just pop him on the scales and weigh him. Oh. Yes, 617 grams. Is that right for a hedgehog? It's about average for this time of year. <sighs> yes, he looks if he's hurt his back leg. Yes. But let's all know. Hedgehog with a poorly leg. Why the hedgehog? He was in the garden in the daylight. Oh. Yes, he has got a broken leg. Oh. How long will it take to mend? It'll be okay in about six weeks. Then we'll be able to release him uh, back in your garden. Oh. But don't worry, he'll be fine, and uh, he can keep this other one company until then. Bye, Spiky. There are lots of sick animals in there, Pippin. I saw 
As one who's got a broken leg, it won't take long to mend. A deer who's getting stronger, and a hedgehog. A badger with a bandage on, an owl and his friend. Who was fast asleep, well almost, and a hedgehog. I love Saint Tiggy Winkles, the helping of the animals. I'm sure you love Saint Tiggy Winkles too. I saw a heron with a broken wing, a magpie who can't fly, a fox who's feeling poorly, and a hedgehog. A kestrel who'll be better soon. Some ducklings walking by. A gull who'll soon be flying, and a hedgehog. I love Saint Tiggy Winkles. They're helping all the animals. I'm sure you love Saint Tiggy Winkles too. What are to do? We had to wait six weeks before Spiky could come home. But at last. Came the day. We were so excited, we got up early and waited. And waited. It seemed like ages. It's fine. <sighs> now, where's he gone? We'd better leave him now and let him settle back into the garden again. He'll be fine. And he was. Oh, and there he is now. He's very late. I wonder what he's been up to. He hasn't lost his appetite. <laughs> dear old Spiky, safe and well. Oh, dear. Come on, Pippin. Time for bed. Now you know all about hedgehogs, don't you, my dears? Good night, Pippin. See you in the morning. <laughs>